As Ebola continues its deadly march across West Africa, the U.S. military has boots on the ground to help stop the disease in its tracks. Last week, soldiers arrived in Monrovia under the command of Major General Darrell Williams, commander of U.S. Army Africa. General Williams says it will take a team effort to resolve this crisis. The U.S. military is not here to solve Ebola. Uh, the CDC, AID, the leadership provided, the government library, the U.S. Embassy here, all the folks that I mentioned, that team of teams is what's going to help stop Ebola or contribute to stopping Ebola. An around-the-clock construction operation is underway to complete the first of 17 U.S.-funded Ebola treatment units. It has a 150-bed capacity that could be ready within days. Military blood labs have also been set up to reduce the wait times for results from several days to several hours.